What is up guys, Patriots here, and welcome back. This is part two of the breakdown video, I guess, uh, with me playing CTF on... What the... I'm drawing a blank now as to what the map's called. <laughs> Alright, we're just gonna skip the map name, because I really can't remember. It's not Backlot, and that's what I want to say. Bootleg, there we go. Got it, got it, got it. Uh, once again, if you didn't see the first video, the annotation is on the screen, but... We are playing against Optic Assassin, and Jared is a G. Uh, Optic Assassin plays for Optic Nation. I guessed the respawn correctly there, however, I I don't want to say I choke on my shot. Basically what happened was, is I had a PP90, he had an ACR. Uh, we both started shooting at the exact same time. Uh, ACR, better at range, beats my PP90. So right there, I'm able to save our flag by coming in with that jump shot with the PP90 from Street. I'm not going to push through mid as I want to be able to get up there, grab flag. We are now down 3-0 at the moment. We need to get something done. Uh, you'll notice that it goes all poorly in a bit, but, you know, for the most part we play pretty well considering that we're not pros, been playing competitive basically for, like, two weeks of game time because, you know, we've been on a team or been on multiple teams for like six weeks, but actual playing has been minimal. Uh, my grenade's not going to get him here. I think that was a Semtex that hit me, but I'm able to get the jump shot and get the return. Right here, I'm able to pick off Assassin, and that is two down, and since it's 2v2, we're going to be able to easily grab the cap here. Uh, I'm now calling out that they're going to respawn back market. They do, and I'm not able to pick up the kills there, so... You know, unfortunately, if I was able to get the kills there, I would have been able to get a quick relay, bring the flag all the way back, and Insane probably would have been able to push up and wait, and maybe if he was lucky, catch them on the respawns again, and absolutely destroy them, and we would have been able to grab another flag and tie everything up. However, that situation did not happen. Uh, I expected him to be closer down by the bricks. He actually played it farther back, which was a nice move on his part. I get taken out. Insane's now pushing up. He's going to grab flag. He's going to come mid. I'm going to try to get up here and cut straight off. And I'm not sure what happens. Okay, they spawn back market, it looks like. And he's getting shot. Uh, I'm told that someone's bike rack. Yep, I remember this situation. I don't get there in time, but I do end up taking him out after uh, he gets to kill Insane. I go up here to grab flag. And if I could just have gotten around this box, I think I would have been able to get it. But I'm not sure that... I'm not... Yeah, oh, that was the beautiful nade by Jared. That was not the box situation. Jared throws a beautiful nade over here to nail me right before we're able to get in the doorway. Uh, props to him. I think me and Insane spent the last uh, three minutes, the next three minutes or so, talking about how beautiful that nade was and how we wanted to go into game chat and like, congratulate him on the most amazing nade of all time. Uh, it was a beautiful nade by uh, Jared there. And props to him, you know. The, the one thing I can say about losing to pros, uh, Fizzerp, I accidentally accepted. He was doing a radar always on, search and destroy, and I didn't want to do that, so we tried to play it, but I just, radar always on is stupid. So I, I quit out of that. We did pick up a round or two, but I just, I didn't want to do it. So we just said, you know, whatever, you win. You just report 2-0 and it's over. And, you know, whatever. Uh, we played against uh, Ego's team. Um, I, I was kind of upset with their classlessness, I'll go with. Uh, they switched to using only pistols because they were up like 3-0 or whatever, which I think was kind of a, a douchebag move. I ended up switching to a sniper because I just didn't really care anymore. But, you know, the one thing I can say is I definitely uh, was happy playing against Assassin and Jared. Uh, they weren't, first of all, assholes. They were cool, and I kind of expect to lose to them. You know, they're good, and I do expect to lose because I have basically zero experience because my teams keep falling apart or if we're on a team we don't play ever and you know it, it, 2v2 is tough because you know one thing goes wrong and everything goes wrong and kinda everything's gonna fall apart here as basically in, in competitive when you're down a bunch of flags everything starts to fall apart because the only thing you're doing is sprinting because you need to get those flags so you start dying more and your flag ends up getting taken because not necessarily because you're dumb or you're bad at the game but you're trying to make up for like three flags and uh, a time period that only allows for three flags so right here I guessed he was gonna spawn in that building I was correct my nade didn't hit him I'm assuming it hit one of the walls over there and didn't get over so he's able to actually pick up the stuns on me as well and get the nade and get me killed so you know, if I was able to do what I should have been able to do there which I should have done which is get the nade up there get the kill I probably would have been able to pick up that flag as assassin would have been spawning in that building with him as well about a minute later 
and I would have been able to pull because I would have gone through mid, and he would not have been able to catch up. But we do lose to Assassin. Once again, good game to those two. Uh, we did lose, but I, I enjoyed playing it. Uh, I was happy uh, with what we were able to do, considering the uh, circumstances we were put in. And uh, overall, I had a I had a good time. I enjoyed playing them. I enjoyed losing to them uh, because you know they're cool. They were cool about it. and They weren't douchebags, and we played them pretty close there. So thank you guys for watching. See you later.